In today's show and tell with Tony, we meet a local couple still sitting side by side after 55 years of marriage. Yeah, and here's the kicker. They're doing that in the same car they've owned since they wed. Here's Tony with their story. My guests today are Bob and Elsa Sinclair, and they have been married for 55 years. Yes, sir. Uh, which is an accomplishment. <laughs> uh, but what they're going to show us today actually predates their marriage. So what are we looking at? Uh, we're looking at a 1959 Triumph TR3A. We met in 63, and I bought this in 64. And, and then it was our honeymoon car in, in 67. We met in Kansas, and my folks were back in New Jersey, and her folks in Florida. So we did a lot of trips back and forth, and then eventually the military dumped me out in Sacramento, so we drove it across the United States. And you packed it up? Oh, <laughs> no, we, every, there, you couldn't have put another toothpick in this thing. We knew where every little thing, wedding dress, everything, this, this, what? everything we owned was in this car. Your wedding dress was in this car. <laughs> yeah, and I have her up there, and I can still wear, I still can wear, I haven't changed much. We drove it all the way across the desert. It had over 223,000 miles on it before I overhauled it. All the way from Miami to, to California, we had to unpack. We stayed in hotels every night, had to unpack everything and then put it back yeah. in the car. <laughs> Elsa, do you drive the car as well? Not anymore, but I learned how to drive in this car <laughs> with three pillows. And, and the steering wheel rubbing my stomach oh my to <laughs> reach a pedal. Is it too much to suggest that the car sort of tells the story of your relationship? I mean, in a way, is it sort of symbolic of the two of you? I would, yes. Yeah, we're close. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> we're getting old. Right. <laughs> but you're in great shape. But we're doing pretty good, yep. <laughs> Guys, this is such a treasure. I, mean, I love cars anyway, but to see uh, the care you've taken uh, and, and the meaning and the value that this is the exact same car, probably better now today than it ever was, uh, that you drove, you know, before you were married 55 years ago. So. Yeah. Just wonderful. Uh, thank you so much for sharing. Well, I appreciate it, honey. Yeah, Thanks for done. coming. <laughs> so neat. Okay, the that. car is so cute, and yeah. they are, are darling. So cute. Right. Yeah. I love yeah, yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's from Cuba, so she's a little bit of accent. Yeah. Um, but yeah, they're just a delightful couple. Uh, and you know, that car has no radio. Can you imagine oh. driving across country in that, and you're just like, Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> wait a minute, and, you're, and no phones, and you had to talk yeah. to each exactly. other. Exactly. What do you know? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, by the way, uh, Bob, I want to make sure I thanked his friends because that's been restored completely. It's beautiful. Uh, Blake, Byrne, and uh, Keith up at Positively, uh, pos foreign parts positively up in Washington. And they so, helped yeah. him redo wow. everything. And oh they yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's stunning. Beautiful. It's they made it better than it was when it was new, but it has yeah. the exact same car. Wow. wow. Pretty cool. Gorgeous. But that yeah. couple just as good as they ever. Oh, yeah. I know. I love <laughs> it. They're darling. Thank you. What a neat, neat oh, story. Yeah. Love that. Yeah.